Hey, this is Norm with Quantum Innovations and I want to talk to you today about water degassing from lenses. So, uh, there's a couple different aspects here that we're going to quickly cover. One of them is relative to the vacuum chamber itself and then the other one is relative to delamination of the coating coming, uh, um, the air coating coming off the lens. So first let's talk about the problems that happen in the air coating chamber itself. So if you think about <clears throat> Uh, anybody who's, who is very familiar with vacuum knows that even a thumbprint can cause, uh, cu can cause problems in pumping in the vacuum chamber. So if we think about the fact that that lens has just gone through the ultrasonic and it's like a sponge, so it's going to hold a lot of water vapor in the outer part of the, of the hard coat itself it's going to hold that water vapor and go into the chamber. Now if there was only one lens it probably wouldn't be a big load on the chamber but because most of the coating chambers that we use are in a batch so we're going to use maybe five pair at a time up to 80 90 pair at a time what that's going to cause is as the as that moisture comes out of the lens which it will uh, it's going to cause that pumping speed to 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 go down the amount of time it takes to pump that chamber is going to go up and then you're going to have lost revenues so uh, if you want to put as many lenses through the the system as possible you need to make sure that all the water vapor is out of the lens so that you can process lenses as quickly as possible now the other part Part of this is is that uh, water vapor being trapped in the lens can cause delamination of the coating off of the lens itself and if you think about this logically you have the the lens itself and then you have water vapor that's trapped in there then you put a coating over the top of that now that that moisture is going to come out and it's going to come out uh, in every direction you can't control it so what will happen is is that it will force its way up through the air coating and cause the air coating to delaminate from the lens and um, and you see this a lot of times you you see the the delamination and you'll see this borne out if you if you test a lens like this in saltwater boil or QUVT or one of the other preferred methods that you want to test you can see it happen uh, as you go through that because that moisture will come out through the lens. So if you have any other questions, contact us here at Quantum Innovations or see us on the website, qtmi.net.